Today I thought I would answer a list of questions that I get about community college for those of you debating whether you should go or not. Um, if I were you, I would go. It's better than not going, and if you wanted to transfer to a university sometime later down the road, you could always do that. The first question, did I choose to go to community college? Yes. In high school, I showed up, did my work to pass my classes and graduate, and that's it. I never tried really hard to get on principal's list or honor roll. I just wanted to leave. Do you want or plan to transfer to university? Um, the only time I plan on going to another school is after I get my Associates of Applied Science degree from community college. I plan on getting my BSN from Centera College of Health Sciences. Do you think community college is a bad thing? Absolutely not, and I'm not just saying that because I go. It's perfect for people who have been out of school for years and want to go back and get a better career, and it's also perfect for people who have strict schedules and they're tired of their dead-end jobs. It's perfect for that. What is my major? Registered nursing. What do you like about community college? The things I like, I love the scheduling. The pricing is a lot cheaper than going to a university. Currently at my community college, the credit hour rate is $145.85. What do you not like about it? Sometimes when I call customer service in different departments, they're kind of rude and they have attitudes and I don't like that. So I would be careful who I hire to work with the general public. Who do you recommend it to? I recommend it to anyone who wants to go back to school, who's on a budget, who's tired of their dead-end jobs, or anyone who just wants a career. Is it hard? It's school, so, you know, there's going to be studying, you're going to have homework, you're going to have reading. Luckily, I haven't had any extremely hard classes. It might just depend on your professors. All the professors I've had, most of them would rather talk verbally and have class discussions as opposed to book work. Why did I choose the community college I'm at instead of a different one? I chose the one I'm at because there's multiple campuses in different cities, so if I moved to a different area, I could always go to that campus and my grades will go with me and I won't have to redo those classes. Do you go full-time? No, I work full-time and working full-time pays for me to go to school part-time. <laughs> do I pay out of pocket or do I get any type of financial aid? I pay out of pocket. Um, I do file a FAFSA, which I'll leave the link down below for anyone who wants to get the ball rolling and start signing up. So the government wanted to give me $301 if I went full-time last semester. So a FAFSA for me is kind of a waste because I don't plan on applying for scholarships or... Um, loans or grants, especially ones I have to pay back because that's just more debt. Is it like high school? If you went during the day, I'm sure it would be like high school because most kids that just graduated go during the day right after they graduate. I go at night, so it's more older, mature people who just want to get it done and get out. Is there anything that you wish that I could change about the campus or the school in general? I would change the lighting in the parking lots to brighter, it's kind of dim out there, and it's kind of scary walking to your car when it's pitch black outside. Do I buy or rent textbooks? This semester, for the first time, I rented my textbooks, and it was under $200. Previously, I've bought my textbooks, and it was over $400. So, renting textbooks definitely pays off, and it's also one less textbook you have at the end of a semester just taking up space. Um, my school also has the option, if you buy a textbook and you don't need it, you can always sell it back to them and they'll give you money for it. If, you, if your book that you need is unavailable to rent, try and get used. If you have to buy, buy it. Amazon also offers textbooks now, so you might be able to save the difference if you look at your school's bookstore website as opposed to Amazon, vice versa. Those are all the questions that I can mainly think of that I always get asked about. If you have any other questions or comments, feel free to leave them and I will answer them as soon as possible.